First ever piece of clothing that Scott ever got. How does a dinosaur roar? Can you make big, big bubbles? What? No more procrastination. We're gonna set up this whole space now for baby number two. Crack with mommy. Took. Want to mix the egg? Yeah, you add. Yeah, here, mix. And won't that come out? That's not a brown egg. That's a yellow yolk and egg white. Your hand, hand, lemon hand. fruit and then it's so daddy. Please lemon fruit and then eat salt. Why did I eat salt? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Chris, fresh from the shower, Hobbs has agreed to take Scotty to grandma and grandpa's house today, so I have the morning to myself. <sighs> and it feels good to have some me time again. Look at this belly. 32 weeks, guys. It's ginormous. Making sure to apply all my skincare, all my facial care, body care, hair care at all times because I remember when I just gave birth. It was so hard for me to take time to even poo or shower or take care of myself. So now that I'm still pregnant and I still have the time and Scotty's very much independent already, make the most out of the time that we have to take care of ourselves. Using my trusty lotion, one tub, to make sure our skin is in tip-top shape. And I'm gonna try to squeeze myself into these leggings that are size extra small and super suited talaga ng leggings na to guys kasi it can stretch over this third trimester pregnancy even though it's a size extra small and it's just a struggle to put on but no. and when I am postpartum it fits and when I get my size back if ever that does happen when I'm back to extra small it fits so Lately, I hate wearing leggings because it's so hard and tight to put on and I can't really lift my legs as much as I want. But I want to be prepared just in the rare occasion that feeling ko gusto ko mag-workout, ready na ako. Wala nang takas, wala nang excuse. So, that's why. It feels so good to have fresh hair out of the shower. I feel like a new woman. <laughs> Every time you have a really sweaty, crappy, not crappy, but just like sweaty, tiring day, and then you hop into the shower and wash your hair. I don't know about you, but to me, it really instantly makes me feel amazing. And I remember when I was a new mom and Scotty had just come out and I was so sleep deprived and I was so tired and I was covered in spit up and milk and everything. It's just showers really became such a luxury moment for me. Like sobrang showers were something that I really looked forward to and something that I took for granted definitely when I was before I got pregnant. So now I'm taking nothing for granted. If there's anything that the pandemic taught me, it's definitely not to take anything for granted. So showers, skincare, hair care, body care, everything. Kasama yan lahat. Today we're gonna go in with 
the Kerastase Genesis Serum Anti-Shoot Fortifiant. Anti-Hair Fortifying Serum, guys. I've talked about this in so many videos because I love it. I'm preparing up for postpartum and I remember like four or five months after I gave birth to Scotty, that's really when my hair fall started coming in. Like legit, when I do this, there would be like so much hair. Look, isa na lang because my hair is strong now. <laughs> but before, grabe, like, nakakatakot yung sa dami ng strands na matatanggal. And then, the more I do it, the more it just keeps falling, like, non-stop. Ngayon, wala na, oh. Like, my sister now, she's single, she doesn't have a kid, but she also is experiencing hair fall. My hands are so slippery from the, ano, from the lotion. Wait, let me open this here. This is like my third, fourth bottle already. I was saying, my sister has thinning hair. Like, you can see, sa top dito, sobrang thinning. So, this isn't only for moms. This is really for anyone who's struggling with hair fall. And what's cool about this, it's going to really strengthen the roots of your hair. I really feel like when I apply this to my hair, I'm being so good to myself. I'm really taking care of myself. Now, it's more of a preventive measure. And I really want to grow my hair long. I don't want to chop it off anymore. So, sana this will really help. I mean, I know it will help. I recommended it to so many people, guys. I realized it's really like skincare pala, you know? Like, what we're focused on is always makeup. Like, what eyeshadow looks good, what blush looks good. But if your hair is healthy, if your skincare game is on point and your skin is good, can you understand my reference? <laughs> it makes all the difference, actually. Like, your hair will look great if you maintain it with serums and hair care products and treatments and stuff like that. In the same way, your makeup will look great if you maintain your skin with a good skincare regimen. Hair care is just as important as skincare. And look at that, my hair is so healthy now. I'm so happy. So strong, see? <laughs> so this time in the morning is really my me time before baby number two comes out. Usually what happens is I wake up at seven in the morning and then I get Scotty from his room, play with him a little, and then we make breakfast together. And then when he goes up to his grandma and grandpa's place, usually I take him, but now Hubs has offered to take him. Um, so I get an earlier head start with my day. And when he's with his Lola, then I can do like all of these things to prep and talk to you guys, which I think you noticed more and more in my vlogs. Na, na parang may time na siya to talk to us in her vanity. <laughs> Before lagging garag, lagging mo lang time. So I'm very thankful for this time to myself. <laughs> Okay guys, look at all of this volume. I finished styling my hair, I used a blow dryer, and then I used the air app. And look, I kid you not, two strands lang ang nahulog sa buhok ko. The <laughs> See? He hates it when I wear black t-shirt. You know what? Georgie is coming with teacher. We're gonna have swimming class na. You want to, you want to change to swimming shorts na? Padung na teacher. Come here first, oi! <laughs> How does a dinosaur roar? Uh, How does a dinosaur walk? A T-Rex. <laughs> Hi, Georgie! Hello! Hi, Georgina! Scotty will be, Scotty will go crazy. I feel like it. <laughs> Hi! Whoa! Hi. This is swimming now. Swimming now! Georgie is there and teacher, go! Georgina! <laughs> Let's swim now, Georgina! Let's swim! Family hug, 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 Drop down. Yes, you are correct. Pick up and drop down. Okay, pick up and drop down. Ready, set, 
Go! Go! <laughs> okay, hold teacher. Whoop! Whoop! Okay, you move your legs. Yes, it's teacher Gabby today. Go! Kick and kick and kick. Move your legs. Kick and kick. Kick and kick and kick. Very good! Okay, we're gonna play with the monkey first later. But you have to show me your bubbles. Can you make big, big bubbles? One. Far so good though yung idea ko sabi ni Bestie. So we are going to do the assembling later, right? Yan so far so good my plan. I think so. Let's see. Remember this was your bed when you were a baby. You don't remember that, no? Hello everyone! Another day, another vlog. We're in my home office where it's super duper messy. And I've been sitting here actually all day. Nandito lang ako. <laughs> I'm like, how am I gonna transform this home office into baby number two's room? I don't know. I can't. I can't. I don't know how. Slater, I asked for his help because he's the master of layouting, but hindi rin niya alam. I don't know. The space is too small. You guys will help me out, okay? Where do I put you so you can see? So right now, my office table is here. And the couch is here. And we were initially planning to put the crib over there by the window. But now that there's an actual playpen here and all his clothes are here and everything, it's so tight. So, what do you guys think? If we put the crib here, which I still have to pull out from my mom's house, then my desk will go here. That way, when somebody opens the door, hindi yung crib ang first makikita. Nakatago yung crib dito. Especially since the air conditioning is up here. It won't be so cold for the baby. But then where will I put the couch? So the couch will have no house. And if the couch will have no room, where will I stay when I'm so tired at wala akong tulog? So my office desk will be here. The crib will be here. The couch will go fly away somewhere. I don't know. That's what I've been doing. Trying to figure out the layout of this place. This is all the clothes so far for baby two. Dami niyang clothes, guys. I already segregated it. And then I realized I shouldn't wash it now because I'm still gonna have like about... Nine more weeks till I pop. Actually, oh, eight weeks na lang till I pop. Ang bilis. Eight more weeks. Actually, feeling ko seven more weeks and then I'll give birth na. So, I don't want this to be super madume by the time I give birth. That's just a little over a month. So, I'm gonna wait a while until I wash it out. You know what? I'll probably pack my hospital bag. I should. Because they said that you should pack your hospital bag at 30 weeks. I'm already 32 weeks. So, I'm late. Ha, <sighs> so many things to sort out. This one I'm gonna put in my room because baby will sleep beside me in the bed. I don't know. I don't know how I had the energy to do all of this last time because now I'm so tired. My stomach is ginormous. <sighs> I remember guys, this was the first ever romper or first ever piece of clothing that Scott ever got. It's from Bamberry. You guys know that I love this brand so much. The most comfortable fabric ever. And I don't know if I should announce this now, but watch out for a little something something with me and Bamberry coming really soon. Um, but yeah, this is Scott's first ever piece of clothing. I still remember it. And this is what he also wore coming home from the hospital for the first time. I bought so much from Bamberry. These are all new, see my tag pa. Because I know Scott was always in a good mood if he wore Bamberry before. Like 
mommy to wear black? Yo, you like mommy to wear yellow? Okay, I will change again. Okay, I will change, baby. Sorry, love. Why you don't like mommy to wear black? Wala na good t-shirt may ego na ko, babe. Mommy tummy is so big, man. Good. I will change later, okay? Okay, mommy will change. Mommy will change. Okay, mommy will change. Come hug mommy back. You know mommy has surprise for you for your snack. It's dessert. <laughs> mommy bobo <laughs> Okay, Bobo. Oop, oop. <coughs> Hold on. Legs, legs. Legs, Dayun. I no one. Hmm? Is More gonna, cake. This is going to have some kiwi love. More cake, okay. Mama drink my sir. Mama drink a my sir. Okay, okay. Ito na talaga. No more procrastination. We're gonna set up this whole space now for baby number two. This is gonna be intense nesting. <laughs> I'm going to attempt to put the crib in, move the bassinet out, arrange everything, and I wish myself luck. Tapping <laughs> with my finger on the window. You keep pushing me away. I should let go. Best of, I stare at you and wonder if you had my eyes to see, would you have found her? Would you be a rock if I'm a twister? All right, guys, here's a little after shot of my nursery slash home office. The desk is over here. The crib is over here. These are empty shelves now in the middle to store baby's things. And these are more empty cabinets here for ba more of baby's things. I am so happy that this is finally arranged now. I feel like my nesting face is almost satisfied. This is a little station where I'm gonna do breastfeeding. And if I have a little guest, maybe Scotty or Sky can stay here with me. I'm just so happy that finally there's a little bit of something that was done today. You know, I keep thinking, I need to do this, I need to do this, I need to do this. And finally, there's a little something that's happening. So there's a little progress here. I'm really, really proud of myself. I can't wait to finish dressing this room up. Maybe we can add something here as a little backdrop for baby. And we're gonna add some sheets here, of course. We're gonna clear this up. We're gonna add all of his little clothes here. And once that's finally done, I'm gonna give you guys another tour. Um, yeah, I'm so happy. Thank you guys so much for joining me. <sighs> <laughs> I can't speak straight or else I'm going to lose my train of thought and also I'm going to have shortness of breath. Oh my goodness. But yeah, thank you guys so much for joining me. Really appreciate your company today and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!